9-11 occurred when I was in my junior year of high school. So in between my junior and senior year of high school, I decided to join the military on the delayed entry program. First deployment was a lot easier, so I did not understand how intense things were actually going to get. Once I landed in Iraq, it was, you hit the ground running. Uh, we, we treated over 1,200 trauma patients and did 450 operating cases. Uh, this Marine came in um, and he went straight from the pad into our OR. And we had to make the decision that this Marine was going to take too much resources. We had a sandstorm coming in. There was going to be too many units of blood that would be used. And in turn, we had to make the difficult decision to let this Marine pass. At that time, I was holding his dog tags in my hands. Coming home, it was very difficult to try to think, why was my life spared? I went to his grave and sat there and began crying. And within 10 seconds, something just punched me. I had to start laughing and it was because I knew that Marine did not want me to be crying for his loss. Later on, meeting Staff Sergeant Richardson's brother, that's when I learned that thing that hit me at the grave, he said, that was my brother. And he would not want me to be suffering and me to be having the anguish and the survivor's guilt.